in order to install modifications like custom recoveries, custom ROMs, custom kernels, and even gain root access, we will first need to unlock the bootloader of the OnePlus 5. And that's what I'm going to show you how to do today. This requires a lot of prep work, so if you're unfamiliar of how to do any of this stuff at the beginning, be sure to check the link below this video as I'll have a full tutorial that will walk you through all of that in a step-by-step -step process. So you're going to need to have some USB drivers installed on your computer, whether that's Google's USB drivers or USB drivers from OnePlus. Then you're going to need to enable developer mode on the OnePlus 5. Then we need to go into developer mode, scroll down a bit, and enable USB debugging mode. And while we're here, we also need to enable OEM unlocking. Then you're going to need to have some ADB and Fastboot tools installed on your PC, whether that is tools directly from Google or minimal ADB and Fastboot tools that I will link to in the full tutorial. And then you're going to need to open up a command prompt exactly where those ADB and Fastboot tools are located in. And if you followed my guide that installs minimal ADB and Fastboot tools, that will create a shortcut on your desktop so you can just double click on that shortcut to open up a command prompt exactly where your ADB and fastboot tools are located in we can then connect our computer to the OnePlus 5 with a USB cable and once that's done we're going to type out ADB space devices and then press enter on the keyboard. It's going to launch the A to B service on our computer. And then we're going to get a prompt on our phone asking us if we want to allow USB debugging from this PC. Just go ahead and tap on the always allow option and then tap on OK. Once you have granted USB debugging access, from your PC to the OnePlus 5. We're going to boot and reboot the OnePlus 5 into fast boot mode, which is also known as bootloader mode. Again, if you're not sure of exactly how to do this, refer to the full tutorial as I will walk you through that step-by-step -step process. Once you have the OnePlus 5 in fast boot mode with the USB cable connected, we can type out the command fast boot space flashing space unlock and then press enter on the keyboard and as soon as you press enter on the keyboard you're gonna see this unlock bootloader screen appear on your OnePlus 5 it's going to give you a little bit of details about what unlocking the bootloader entails going to tell you that it will delete all of your personal data by unlocking the bootloader and from here we get two choices we can either continue and unlock the bootloader or we can decline and then it'll just restart the phone so we just want to press the volume up or volume down button until the yes option is highlighted and then we can press the power button to select that option Now we're going to get this warning since our bootloader is unlocked every time we boot up. So that is normal. And if you don't want to wait at that screen, you can just press the power button to skip through it each time. Once that factory reset is done, it's going to boot up our OnePlus 5 into the regular Android operating system. 
This is going to take a little bit of longer than normal during this first boot cycle because we have just done a factory reset. So Android has to set some stuff back up. And then it's going to take us to the Android activation screen. And there you have it. That is how to unlock the bootloader of the OnePlus 5.